George Corps, Peter Fisher, Carol Corps, and you're watching Rock and Metal News. Hey guys, this is Ron from YouTube's Rock and Metal News with a Rock and Metal News update. Yes, have released a new song. It's their first song in seven years, and it's titled The Ice Bridge. And it's the opening track off their new upcoming album, and it's seven minutes long. Uh, uh, you got to check the track out. I don't know if anyone's uh, familiar with Emerson, Lake, and Powell, but they uh, did this uh, album back in the 80s, and there's a song called Touch and Go. And I'll tell you, the opening couple notes of this track are the exact notes and uh, the exact tones of that song. When it opened up, I, it just brought me back to that song anyways. Check it out. Um, the band consists of Steve Howe, Alan White, Jeff Downs, John Davison, and Billy Sherwood. The new album is titled The Quest, and that's going to be out October the 1st. Um, I'm definitely a John Anderson fan on vocals, a uh, long-time Yes fan, but I'll tell you, this song is pretty cool. Uh, I really enjoyed it. So uh, if you can get past that it's not John Anderson singing, this is a pretty cool track. 11 songs, there's 8 on their main CD and 3 on a bonus CD. And the quest is going to be out on vinyl and 5.1 Blu-ray and CD. The album was produced by Steve Howe, so uh, it's pretty cool. I hope the other stuff is very similar to this. Um, I thought uh, Jeff Downs just did an amazing job on this. The keys are really cool. And of course, you got all the other stuff, a real cool Steve Howe guitar work on it. And uh, yeah, check out the track. And I'd definitely like to know what you think of the song. Uh, in the comments, if you just put aside that John Anderson isn't singing. This is Ron from YouTube's Rock and Metal News. Thanks for tuning in.